skies remained overcast for most of the weekend. It didn't stop people from going to the fair. TV6's Jennifer Perez stopped by the Gogiba County Fair to give us a look. When the fair's in town, everyone comes out. But what keeps this tradition alive each year? I enjoy like all the activities they do, like I don't know, like the rides and then like the mud run I'm excited for. Funnel cake is definitely amazing. Deep fried Oreos, deep fried candy bars, Twinkies you get whenever you come to a fair. It's the 93rd annual Gogibbet County Fair and for the first time ever, exhibits and competitions were open to everyone, not just local residents. However, attendance dropped by 33% this year. Officials believe it's because the UP State Fair was on the same weekend. Even though our attendance has been down, our community still continues to support our kids. So they had the livestock auction last night and the prices are up 43%. So we are so happy to support our kids and reward them for a job well done. The fair board also honored two volunteers with the Lifetime Achievement Award. The 4-H pie contest was a hit with 26 entries. Pies are judged on their appearance, aroma, flavor, crust, and filling. You get anything from fruit pies that are very, very sweet to very, very tart or something in the middle. Uh, some of the other pies were using different fillings, uh, chocolates or pecans. This year they had 14 rides and 26 vendors, but new was their craft beer contest and wheels and motors. Jennifer Perez, TV6 News, Ironwood.